Hi guys, it's Big Fish and Tarot here, and I'm going to just do a collective reading. Sorry, I haven't been on for a while. We went back into lockdown for a week. Um, yeah, and I'm finding it hard to upload my videos for some reason still. But anyway, collective reading, all signs. I hope everyone's well. Remember, vice versa, take what resonates, leave the rest. I thought I'd use these tattoo tarot, they are quite big, so they're hard to shuffle, but they're quite cool. So, collectively, what do we need to know? What are the messages we need to know? All signs. All signs. Seven of Wands reverse. Seven of Wands is about protection, maybe protection orders. I've got some star anise. Anyway, do that again. No, one more time. Oh, what I say about the Seven of Wands, it's up right now, it was sideways before the devil in reverse. So maybe dealing with a Capricorn or some energy that's um, demanding. It's codependent, it's addictive, it's sexual, it's shopping, it's alcohol, it's drugs, it's mental health issues. It's in reverse. Is someone seeking treatment finally? I'd say it's forced because they've hit rock bottom. Or you're discovering that you're not bound. <coughs> Sorry. See throat chakra is closing up a bit that you're not bound to this person anymore or the situation that you can break free you're not really chained to it all the magicians are two majors guys big week happening um the magician can manifest anything as above so below um but with the devil it could be a very manipulative energy a sociopathic energy a controlling energy, maybe dealing with someone that has facial hair, maybe dealing with someone that's got darker hair but a lighter skin, a manipulative energy needing to hopefully seek some treatment this week. Three of coins reversed because you know there's financial difficulties, financial difficulties or third party situations at work for the magician reversed toxic behavior maybe being exposed this week someone swearing i just for some reason someone may be going to court you might not know about it but they have to swear on the bible or they have to just um swear they're telling the truth i've got that option and they probably won't choose the bible uh, moon reversed oh so look at this, the devil reversed and the moon reversed on either sides of the magician and the three of coins. The truth is coming out about a situation of someone who's very manipulative when it comes to money. Manipulation regarding money will be coming out this week. Is that you? Is that someone else? Have you been waiting for this to happen? Just thinking because of the full moon with the moon card and just the reverse you know I've, i'm in an area of the world where we've just had um some ma large earthquakes where it did create a tsunami even though it was small there's a ripple effect so there's an a large event that created a tsunami for us it was small but if there's another one it could be a lot bigger so there's almost like there could be a tsunami coming for someone and they might not be aware of it because it happens at night. There could be a raid at night of someone's house. Mm. Queen of Coins reversed. So this person's clearly taken money from a female. It could be a female. Someone's lying about money. Someone's unstable when it comes to money. Um, there could be a partner in crime when it comes to money. There could be two people here or three people involved like a partner and a a wife and a husband and wife and a business partner 
whatever's happening, there's some real dishonesty when it comes to money, manipulative energy. The Hermit. Four mages in five cards. See the beard again? Someone might be forced into reflecting on what they've done or someone's reflecting on what they've done and they, they're trying to work out whether they tell the truth finally or whether they just keep going with the lie, keep manipulating. What do I do? Or is the manipulation or the fact that money's gone missing going to be highlighted this week? Knight of Swords, a lot of watching and, and spying and, and rushing in to make decisions and could be a young cop working on this. It could be a case where a young police officer is working on the case and maybe they rush in and they're not quite right or they don't quite. There needs to be a senior person. If the King of Swords comes in, I feel like there's you know, a young person working on this case that needs to get advice from a senior officer. Seven of Coins. So it's just the beginning, but there's like... There's an investigation going on here when it comes to money, guys. Is this family? Is this business? There's been a lot of dishonest behavior when it comes to money. Again, six of coins. Could be family money because it's the six. It's reversed. No balance, no give and take. Agreements signed that weren't um, legit. Fake, false documents. I am who I say I am. No, you're not. The fool. Someone might have been taking money to start a new journey or taking money. Someone might leave in the middle of the night. Someone might go missing with some money. Look at the dog. It's like a swag, like going for a, um, going into the outback, like the Australian outback. Go walk about, go missing. See the dog there? There's a couple of dogs here, but dogs are really loyal. So is someone loyal to this person or is this person uh, only loyal to themselves? Knight of Wands could be dealing with a fire sign. Two knights, maybe two people investigating, two young, young guys that both are quite passionate about what they're doing. Hopefully passionate about stopping what's going on. Or oh, the emperor. So that is that could be a fa it could be a father figure, uncle, a masculine figure in the living, in the dead. Um, this could be a judge. This could be someone watching over the situation. This could be someone making a judgment call on this situation. A lot of majors. So it's a big week. Five of Wands. A lot of conflict, guys. So I think this could be about. And there's hearts there. I think it is a family situation, but it could be work. Oh, wow. What I say about balance and justice, this is a legal situation. Money being taken, money being stolen. Someone's new journey could be accountability. Finally being held accountable for the shit that they fucking put people through. Six of Swords reverse. So someone might be planning to get away, but they can't get away. And they're trying to do it in the middle of the night, but someone stops them in the middle of the night. Someone can't get away. Eight of Cups reverse. Eight of Cups is about walking away and leaving what you have. Six of Swords is about walking away into karma, clearer waters. These are both reverse. Someone wants to start again, new identity, new location, but they might be stopped right in their tracks. Queen of Swords reversed. I did I did say King of Swords, but Queen of Swords, someone's purse could be um, a fire, uh, air sign. Someone's really annoyed at what they're seeing, at possibly the opportunities to stop this person doing what they're doing, but no one would listen. No one would fucking listen, eh? Two more. Nine of Wands reversed. It's been a burden to carry, but it's not yours to carry anymore. We've got people in authority looking at this now. It's not your burden to fucking carry. And even though it was for a long time, <laughs> Ace of Swords reverse. So someone doesn't want the truth to come out, but it's going to come out. It's going to come out. Family, Four of Wands reverse. Family situation, someone that you had a family with maybe. Hmm. 
someone wants to get away the Hierophant you know I think someone's really put themselves in a situation where um, it's bad it's bad enough to get the law involved um, they might not have any other chances left now because they might have already been involved with the law um, so they could be facing something like prison and they're thinking about desperately thinking about um, leaving in the, in the middle of the night but they'll get caught doing that this person whoever it is needs to watch their back because when you're dealing with stealing from people or it could be drugs or anything like that and if you're trying to rip people off you know just because the law doesn't get involved to teach you a lesson doesn't mean someone else isn't going to come in I mean people take the law into their own hands all the time so I almost feel like someone might have to hide or thinking about hiding because someone that they stole from is pissed and that they 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 feel that the authorities are taking too long to make something happen wow no oh, i might even do okay i'll do an angel reading for this the elements so fire what do you need to know for this week fire fire breathe archangel Raphael. take several deep breaths and ex exhale slowly to awaken your energy and to release old patterns breathe guys it's all coming together. Breathe. Um, air signs. Air signs. Archangel Uriel. You know what to do. Trust your inner knowledge and act upon it without delay. You know exactly what's going on. Look at the lantern. Are you the person shining the light? Look at these lanterns. A light is being shone upon bullshit. And it's long overdue. And you know it's long overdue. And they do as well. Uh, water signs. That flipped. Peace comes from remembering that love, that only love is real. I talked about this about the loyalty with the dogs. You know, there is people, there are people out there that are loyal. Not just to you, but to the job that they're supposed to do. Especially if they're in the authorities. Because, you know, just because someone's a police officer doesn't mean that they actually want to do a really good job and help. A lot of people just want to do the paperwork and go home and wear the uniform. There are some officers, police officers, detectives that want to help victims. There's not a lot, truthfully, but there are some. Earth signs, earth signs, what do you need to know? Oh, victory. Archangel Sandifont, your prayers have been heard and answered. Have faith. Victory is here, guys. And the victory could be in the form of justice, karma, balance, just mental balance after everything that's gone on. Might just do a three oracles, oh four, because I'll just do one for the elements too. What do we need to know about this situation? What does fire signs need to know about this situation? Fire signs, fire signs, what do you need to know? Despair, Oh. Someone's in despair. Um, someone does not know what to do. They put themselves in a tough situation. Someone could be suicidal about this. It could be because they've lost money or it could be because they know they're getting caught. Um, I don't want anyone to feel suicidal, even if that they have it's sort of self-inflicted because they know they're going to get in trouble for what they've done. It's not a it's not right. Um, but that could be what someone's facing. A red chair, the red chair, red flag. Okay, ear signs, ear signs. Message. So you could get a message about this. Ear signs, um, letters coming in, affidavits, summons. So there could be something going on for you. Water signs. An apology. Water signs. Oh, falseness, water signs. Well, there we go, the magician. Couldn't get falser than that. So someone around you is being false. Someone that's false is going to be exposed. A wolf in sheep's clothing. The truth is coming out. And someone doesn't like it. Earth signs. Earth signs. I think earth signs there was a few, um, oh, a few messages coming out. Misfortune. That's a tower card. It's 
really interesting. I used to talk about, because I obviously um, had a marriage to a sociopath, narcissist, a malignant, covert sociopath. Awful. And when I used to think about how he manipulated people and would gaslight and, and commit crimes, and he was a kleptomaniac or is a kleptomaniac, this is what I would say to people. So this could link to something I could be going through. This He is the type of person, and these sociopaths, this is the type of people that they are. They don't just want to set the house on fire, right? They want someone to be in it. They want to cause that much fucking destruction, like a pyromaniac. They're not content with just setting the house on fire. They want people to be in the house when it fucking burns. That's how disgraceful they are. Okay, facts sociopaths they're out there they marry people they work with you they start relationships with you, with you they're in your family they're in your neighborhood narcissistic low vibrational demonic entities that just cause havoc and wreak havoc wherever they go and they get a fucking kick out of it they get a kick out of it because they sit back and they watch while people are in turmoil and it's from what they created. So this person who's created two more for, for you is in despair because they're getting caught. Security camera. <laughs> Victory is on its way. Because the truth, which has been hidden for a long fucking time, is about to be revealed. So good luck, guys. Um, let me know how it goes.